All right, my first potato experiment, kinda, maybe my second one. So last year, I put potatoes at the very bottom and then as the greens would pop through the soil, I would add more dirt and then keep doing that all the way up. And in theory, I thought if I planted potatoes here, as I hilled them, they would, there'd be more potatoes along all these levels of hilling. And how a potato grows is, grows up and off the main stem, there's tubers that go sideways. And then off those tubers is where the potatoes grow. So if there's more dirt and you hill them and you let the greens get some sunshine, thought I'd get more potatoes, but I only have potatoes from pretty much halfway up and the rest was just bare soil and not really big potatoes. So I think I hilled them too much. And I got this experiment idea from this compost bin. So what I did was I threw a really ugly, really bad looking potato at the very bottom and it grew all the way to the top until it could find some sunshine. And I thought it was a weed, but it was potato. So I was like, okay, if I hill it, maybe there'll be more potatoes coming out of it, which was not. So then in this garden bed, I planted them and then I'm just gonna let them grow. Plant them about a foot deep and I'm not gonna do anything with it. Just let it grow. Let all the greens go through the soil and then just let it thrive as much sunshine as it wants until the potatoes are ready. I'm gonna see how big the potatoes are and how many I get. And then the real other experiment that I'm doing is right over here. So this is a kind of a thin bucket. I have a potato down here. And what I'm gonna do is let everything go through the soil, all the greens, but I also planted a potato halfway up. So what I'm gonna be doing is planting a potato here and here. And I wanna see how it grows and if I get more potatoes than last year, cause didn't get very much last year. It was not a success with how much time and effort it took. So hopefully more potatoes, less space in theory, wish me luck.